In this video, we are going to demonstrate a pulse oximeter application using the IFC 5043 Bluetooth module on the IFC 5651 board. This means the IFC 5043 Bluetooth module is in standalone mode and the MSP430 on board is not used at all. There are a few things that you need to prepare. Firstly, you need to download the 5043 Oxy SPP package from the link shown on the screen. In this package, you will find the firmware and software components required to do this demo. Other equipment that you will need are a PC with Bluetooth hardware. For example, some newer laptops comes with integrated Bluetooth radio. Or you can use a Bluetooth USB dongle like this. And this PC must be installed with Bluetooth software component, including stack and serial port profile. This demo uses the Bluetooth stack that is available in the Microsoft Windows XP Service Pack 2. And as a hardware component, the use, this demo uses the Bluetooth USB dongle that you saw earlier. You also need to install the iFoundry Oxy Client Pass Oximeter application. This is part of the 5043 Oxy SPP package described earlier. And you also need to get hold of the BCI Oxy Link Pass Oximeter from Smith's Medical. You will need the one with the serial connector. And lastly, you need to download the 5043 Oxy SPP firmware into the Bluetooth module. Now let's configure the board. Set the mode jumper to norm. Set the LED cell jumper to 5043. Set the 5043 CONN jumper to EXT or external. Now let's connect the pulse oximeter to the third serial port. And let's power up the board. After the board is powered up, you will see that the red LED and yellow LED are blinking alternately. This indicates that the Bluetooth stack is up, and the board is in discoverable and connectable mode. In this video, we will skip the pairing process, as it will be different on different platforms. Basically, this pairing process is to get both devices, the IFC 5043 and the PC, to authorize each other. Now, let's run the Oxy client. Now select the port name. This should be the outgoing SPP COM port created during the pairing process. Click Open COM port. Now you will notice that only the red LED is blinking and the yellow LED is off. This means that the SPP connection is already established. Click on the power on to turn on the oximeter. Also insert your finger into the finger sensor of the pulse oximeter. Now the Oxy client is receiving data from the IFC 567 board via SPP over Bluetooth. It will take a while for the platysmograph data to be transferred from the pulse oximeter to the board and subsequently to the Oxy client application. Here we see that the pulse oximeter is connected to the board and the data from the pulse oximeter is transmitted over Bluetooth to the Oxy client application. Now let's turn off the pulse oximeter and close the COM port. After the connection has been closed, the yellow and the red LED are blinking alternately again. Thank you for watching this video. For more information, please visit our website shown on the screen.